Ryland Regional Medical Center installing new technology to help protect newborns at their facility. NBC5's John Hawks got a look at how the new technology works to keep families safe. Rutland Regional Medical Center unveiling a new high-tech piece of medical equipment geared towards keeping newborns safe. And what this does is it takes a digital imprint of baby's footprints, a digital imprint of mom's fingerprint, and a digital photo of baby's face. It's a means of identification for law enforcement agencies in case of an emergency. In the event that mom and baby ever get separated through natural disaster, abduction, we can easily access those digital images. Parents in the hospital have login information to a national database. The process is simple and easy. We have a little scanner here. They have the armbands. We scan the armbands. They identify the baby by the number of the armbands, which matches up to the mums. The baby's feet are scanned in using this box on the cart. It has an additional benefit, allowing parents to use the images for making T-shirts, mugs, or even tattoos. The scans are free and optional but are recommended by one of the first families to use it at the hospital. It was a quick process. I mean, I don't think it's, it's, it's a hard process. I mean, every, every parent should do it. It took literally five minutes. Parents can rest easy knowing that this information is there to help in an emergency. Yeah, it does give us a peace of mind. I mean, if, like I said, I mean, if something, if something happens, that way at least you, you know, it's on a database and uh, it's easy to track your children. The scanner is made by a company called CertiScan Technologies. They're the only one who makes the device. It comes recommended by the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. And Rutland is the only hospital in Vermont that has one. Previously, we have been giving parents an ink and paper footprint of baby, and that's strictly just a keepsake. The medical center says that it has other security measures in place. This is just another one they feel is important to provide. In Rutland, John Hawks, NBC5 News.